about that kind of growing up in an Italian neighborhood or? Well, there were small uh, Italian neighborhood is down north, known as the North End right now. There's a famous restaurant there called Morozo's, which has a little history in the Kansas City entertainment business. They filmed the movie here years ago called Kansas City, and the owner, Mike Morozo, got his first movie start in the movie Kansas City, and the pictures are all over the walls at the restaurant. And people tend to go there to get a little feel of a little Italy. There's a LaSalle sandwich shop. There's a Caddyshack bar and grill there that's owned by uh, Joe Mortina and Mortina's Pizza. Um, there's quite a few little Italian establishments in the area that still have a lot of heritage. And, and those people are kind of a tight-knit group, you know, and the same with the Irish and the different, you know, nationalities around the area. They kind of stick together, and at times they fought, and at times they haven't. And what Jesse tried to do with this movie is play on the history of Kansas City from what he told me on the Italian organized crime and maybe kind of make it a little more flamboyant and ad lib on the Italians having a problem in Kansas City with the Irish. Yeah, anything else you want to add to it? Uh, any thoughts on the production, uh, your experience so far? Uh, I like how Jesse's tied in uh, original people, you know, trying to find Irish characters for the Irish parts and real Italian people for the Italian parts. And, and each one of those, he's kind of discussed a role with and got feedback from. So I think it makes it more natural and original as opposed to, you know, having a guy do something he's never done before. You're getting a feel of it from whether it's Jesse's perception on how he wrote it or the individual actor's perception of how they're doing in their scenes. Joe P, thank you so much, man. I appreciate it. Thank You're you. Welcome. Cool.